The following program was produced by the United States Courts. Hello, I'm Javier Hernandez with the United States Courts. When Philadelphia's Third Circuit Court of Appeals began to run out of room for its judges, the court came up with a unique plan to add space while avoiding additional costs. Non-resident Third Circuit judges often travel hundreds of miles to Philadelphia to preside over court business. Using new, integrated workplace principles, the court has made its space more efficient by helping multiple out-of-town judges share space that previously served just one judge. This project is part of a larger initiative to save space and money across the judiciary. Donna Wilson has more from Philadelphia. As four of the Third Circuit's judges face senior status and in anticipation of more judicial appointments, the Third Circuit had some decisions to make about chamber space. By shrinking the individual space for each judge who is a non-resident judge and who only comes in periodically, we've been able to free up space to use for new judges, active service judges who come on board. Instead of constructing new chambers or securing rental space, the Third Circuit decided to remodel three existing non-residential circuit judges' chambers. They constructed suites. This project allowed us to avoid having to acquire uh, up to four chambers, three to four chambers at approximately 2,000 square foot piece. So right there, we'll average it out to 8,000 square feet. The entire effort saved more than $200,000 a year in rent payments. And since it's not ground up construction, it saved about four and a half million dollars in construction cost. Beyond the savings, the space is comfortable. We have ergonomic sitting um, a seat and also a benching system so that it adjusts to any shape and form size of person. We also have seating areas such as over here. Uh, we call it breakout areas so that a law clerk staff can break away from their desk. The Third Circuit Chambers are an integrated workplace with an open floor plan. This largely wall-free design allows judges and staff to collaborate easily. Since non-resident judges here may travel hundreds of miles to preside over the Third Circuit, this integrated workspace promotes mobility. And technology plays a huge role in the chamber's appeal. Access to case files from anywhere in the circuit is at the touch of a button. Between the VOIP phones, between the telepresence units that we have set up uh, in one of the chambers, and uh, certainly the, the virtual desktops really allow for that mobility. With striking views of iconic Independence Hall, neither the judges nor their staffs could have asked for a better end result. It does change the feeling of the law clerks. It's easier for them to work. It's easier for me to work as well. You know, I don't have that great big space, but I've got something better, I think, in exchange for giving up the trappings of the office. You know, when we're working on something and I need to get a hold of someone, I can just literally just turn my chair around and say hello. Everything's new, it's nice, it's, it makes you feel like you're right at home doing your work, so I really like it. With the cost savings, the updated technology, and the modern aesthetic, these chambers may be a model for other judges' chambers across the country. The Third Circuit is proud to set that example. For Judiciary Now, I'm Javier Hernandez in Washington.